Morning after an 18 year old was killed in an accident in Plainfield. Sydney Willis died just days before the start of her softball season at Cloverdale High School. Fox 59's Eric Graves shows us how neighboring teams and towns are honoring Sydney. Saturday afternoon, a red truck and a blue car collided with each other here just off of I-70 in Plainfield. Three teenagers in the blue car were taken to the hospital. One of them, 18-year-old Sydney Willis, died from her injuries. Sydney was a senior softball player at Cloverdale High School. It's for a moment of silence for uh, Miss Sydney Willis. Since the crash, support has been coming in from several neighboring towns and teams. Owen Valley opened its softball season Tuesday night with a moment of silence for Sydney. Two communities have connections. People work together, people know each other. We're roughly 20 miles or so apart, if that. Sydney died just days before her senior season was set to begin. Each player on the Owen Valley team wore a green ribbon in their hair for Sydney and to show her family they're behind them. This isn't about competition tonight. The ribbons, it's, it's about supporting that community, our neighbors, um, the family. That's what this is about. Kimball Richardson is a licensed mental health counselor with Community Health. He says memorials like this one are very important. To heal, being able to come together as a community to support each other and eventually to have that person's memory live on in a meaningful way. Even in this tragedy, there is hope for others. Sydney Willis was an organ donor. Families that are impacted by this uh, are, are in the thousands, and, uh, and one donor can make a huge difference. Mark Bank with the Indiana Donor Network says there are more than 100,000 people waiting for a donation, and about 1,000 of those people are here in Indiana. One donor can save up to eight lives through organ donation and heal up to 75 others through tissue donations. Reporting in Spencer Air Graves, Fox 59 News. Mark Back says they also provide grief support and help for families of donors for years to come.